In 1966, Samuel Merritt expanded to include a new entity called Studio 3. A faculty member and Merritt staff nurse named Betty Moffitt envisioned that the future of education lay in television. So she worked out a grant with the Helene Fould Health Trust to fund a television studio in classroom number three in Lower Town Court. Betty, knowing nursing but little about television, hired a consultant to get the studio running. Together, they produced numerous videos on all aspects of nursing. These were like edited and, you know, pretty, pretty, you know, for the time, go back and look at them now, they're pretty rudimentary, not too good, but at the time they were great, <clears throat> certainly landmarks. Well, uh, the trust was ecstatic, they thought it was great, so they gave more equipment. And at that point, the following media production is made possible through a grant from the Helene Fould Health Trust for student nurses throughout the United States and abroad. Each producing school... They eventually moved from black and white studio television to location production using color, broadcast quality, three-quarter inch video. In almost every single theory class or clinical class, we had the opportunity to use the equipment in Studio 3 for a project about something we might be doing in clinical, such as uh, something to demonstrate like catheterization of a patient or uh, body mechanics or that sort of business. So Studio 3 played uh, a major part in most of our lives. Studio 3 continued to evolve and has expanded into what today is a self-supporting entity, which produces videos for all facets of the healthcare community, including a weekly nationally televised program for nurses.